This video content is not intended for children. Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. Well, it's nighttime. I got about a half hour to fish, so I'm going to stop talking and get fishing. So, yeah, like I said, I got about a half hour before the sun is gone, gone, and I can't see anything. Let's flip around this dock and fish the boat ramp and see if we can't get a bass or two. Just curious if I'll get a bite dragging it along the top. Swimming out on top like a frog. Fish, fish on. There we go. Small little largemouth bass. Got him while dragging it along the top. Hooked in the side of the mouth pretty good. There we go. Just a little guy here. Look at quarter pounder with cheese. But he came up and he nabbed it as I was dragging it along the top of the water. Rod tip high, keeping it moving, right? Keep those claws flapping. Quarter pounder with cheese, came up and grabbed it. So yeah, I got that one small bass dragging that craw across the top of the water. I'm not gonna catch anything else here. So let's go back to the studio and open up some mail. We're gonna do a late night mail opening and giveaway. See ya in the studio. I'm Elston Perez with Chunky Cats Fishing. And right now you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Woo! Pepsi. Shoot, I ain't crazy. All right, we're back in the studio, and I got some mail to go through. I actually have a backlog of mail, so we're going to try and get through a few packages. And if you sent something and don't see it on today's episode, we'll try to get to it next time. Anyway, let's just get into it. This first package here is from Andy in Henrietta, New York. Let's see what we have here. We have a Bagley crankbait in a shad pattern. Good looking bait here. This is the BX404 made in Serbia. I didn't know they made lures in Serbia. Good looking crankbait there. Let's see what else we have. Here we have a package of Eagle Claw laser sharp hooks. Can't tell exactly what kind of hook that is, but it looks like a kale hook. Points are forged and rotary honed to create the sharpest possible point. Good looking hooks here. Let's see what else we got. We got Carl's amazing baits. These look like little crappie baits. A little grub with a single tail. Here's a Sussex Supreme spinner bait. Trout bass pike. Invented in 1930, Sussex spinners have attracted the majority of fishermen. Well, they have attracted the majority of fishermen. Let's see what else we got. We got the classic Roadrunner. Slow presentation, flash plus vibration equals more fish. We got a quarter ounce Roadrunner with a boot tail swim bait. That's a good looking bait. I actually might be able to catch something on this. Here we have a small tackle box with some jointed swim baits inside. These might be considered wake baits. I'm not sure if they float or not. They sure look pretty. Segmented plastic swim bait, wake bait thing. 
I'm not sure what brand this is, but it has sharp nickel hooks on it. So yeah, I got five of them here. These are interesting. I might be able to catch a bass on this, as long as I can fish it where there aren't any weeds. Here's another Bagley crankbait. This is a Balsa Shad 08. That's a much bigger crankbait with a much bigger lip. Pretty sure I need some deep water to fish this guy. Good looking bait though. Nice design. And last but not least, we have the Lake Lunkers Crappie Crank. So there's a small little crappie crankbait here from Lake Lunkers. Not familiar with that. So yeah, nice variety here. Thanks again to Andy in New York for sending it in. I'm excited to try the Roadrunner and Small Bagley, and who knows what else I might catch on the rest of this assortment. Thanks again to Andy for sending it into the show. Hi, I'm John from Northern Grit, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Let's see what else we got. Here's a package from Mike in Urbandale, Iowa. And there's a letter right on top. Let's see what it says. It says, Dear Alex, thank you for the great channel. I love your approach and your honesty. Recently, I've been disappointed to see some of the BS negative comments and the footage of the fishermen who walked right through the middle of the river you were fishing. Ass wipes are everywhere. So when I saw these jars in stock at my local Bass Pro, I remembered you mentioning that these are becoming harder to find. So I decided to put some good back into the world. Being stuck in the upper Midwest, I enjoy watching people catch any fish, and your channel is a go-to. Thanks for all you put into your content, and for keeping it realistic. P.S. If you want to keep them, keep them. If not, add them to a giveaway for someone else. Alright, thanks Mike for sending in a box of lures to the show. I can already see a bunch of cool stuff. Let's just get right into it. Here's a small tackle box with a few random crankbaits. We got a lipless crankbait. We got a small crankbait here. We got a grasshopper. We got a small lipless crankbait here. And a spinner. Good little variety here. Actually, this grasshopper looks like a popper. This is something I've never seen before. We have a topwater popper shaped like a grasshopper. That's pretty cool. Here we have a package of Biospawn Plasma Tails. Neat little drop shot type worm here. I have caught bass on this in the past. I know that works. Here's a package of Grande Fishing Airtail Flash. This looks like a fluke and a plastic worm had a baby. Right? So it's got a fluke body and a plastic worm tail. Here's another Grande Fishing Lure. This is the Baby Rattlesnake. It's like a segmented stick worm. Here's another Grande Fishing Bait. We have the Airtail Wiggler. So it's a plastic worm with that kind of beehive looking tail. Here's another package of Grande Fishing. We got the 8 inch Mega Tail Rattlesnake. Plastic worm with a curl tail. 8 inches is pretty long. And a 5 and a quarter inch Airtail Salty Stick. Here's a stick bait with a modified tail. Pretty cool. Let's see what else we got. We got a package of Yum Christy Craws. I have used this with success in the past. And a package of Yum Swimming Grubs. It's like a little short worm with a curly tail. Here we have some Gulp Minnows in Chartreuse Shad. One of my favorite baits right here. Great panfish bait. They can be hard to find. 
Here's another one, Emerald Shiner, one of my favorite colors. And Smelt Color, another one of my favorites. Awesome variety here. Thanks again to Mike for sending it into the show. Gulp Minnows, my favorite. And we got a variety of other soft plastics here. He said keep them or give them away. So we'll start making a pile for the giveaway. We'll give away the Biospawn Plasma Tails. We'll give away the Grande 8 inch Megatail Rattlesnake. And we'll give away the Airtail Flash. We'll start the giveaway with these items right here, courtesy of Mike. I'm going to get this cleaned up and we'll be right back. Hey guys, it's Cynthia the Fishing Mommy from The Fishing Family. You're watching Realistic Fishing and you've got to listen to Mom when I say, keep it realistic. This package is from John in State Line, Mississippi. We have a letter here. Let's see what it says. Hey, Mr. Alex, I've been watching your show for the past three or four years, and I enjoy how you have a realistic point of view. In this package, I have sent, well, he's naming all the baits, so I'm going to skip this part. It says, I was wondering if you would like to trade. I'm sorry if some of my baits have been used or open. Thanks, John. All right. Well, thanks for sending mail into the show, John. Let's see what baits he sent, and then we're going to check out some baits that I'm going to send back. All right, first bait here is the Zoom Z-Craw in Watermelon Seed. That's a good-looking bait. I can probably catch a fish on that. Here's a Big Bite Baits. I don't know the name of it, but it is a brush hog. Took me a second there. This is a copy of a full-size brush hog. I hear a crankbait in here somewhere. Let's see what it is. All right, here's a War Pig lipless crankbait in a shad pattern. All right, inside of that package was a jig with a craw trailer. This looks like a Yamamoto or something. Also, a chatter bait with a boot tail swim bait. And a swim jig. Let's see what else is in here. Here we have a package of Gary Yamamoto hooks with a random jig head inserted. Here's a package of Super Salt Plus Green Pumpkin Worms by Zoom. Here's a package of Goo 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 Gin Baits Kraken Craws. EcoPro Tungsten Swim Shad 3.8. Looks like this one might have worked for him. There's a couple missing. Here's some Super Salt Plus Super Flukes. Here we have a Zoom Swamp Crawler in Bold Bluegill. That's a good looking worm. This looks like everything. So, thanks again to John for sending some mail into the show. Got a good variety of soft plastics here, a crankbait, and a couple of jigs. Now it's my turn, so I'm going to go pick a few items to send back to John, and I'll be right back. Vance here from Fishing with Vance. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. John, this is what I'm sending back to you. We got the Jackal Yammy Fish. We got some KVD Perfect Plastic Ochos. We got some Z-Man TRD Hogs. We're sending an H2O Express two-bladed spinnerbait. Berkeley Powerbait Max Scent the General. Some Missile Twin Turbo. A 
Strike King Bitsy Bug, and a Storm Wigglewort. Thanks again to John for sending mail into the show. He requested a trade, and since I'm a nice guy and he caught me on a good day, I'm willing to do the trade. Expect this package in the mail, John, and thanks again for sending something into the show. And courtesy of John, we're going to add something else to the giveaway here. We're going to add the Zoom Swamp Crawlers in Bold Bluegill. All right, let's see what we have in the giveaway. We have four packs of soft plastics. Let's sweeten the pot a little bit. Added to today's giveaway is an original rattle trap and a storm wiggle wart. So, if you want to be entered to win this drawing, a little bit realistic fishing, a little bit generous subscribers, all you have to do is be subscribed, leave a thumbs up on the video, and leave a comment below. And I'll pick a random winner in a future video. And now it's time to pick the last giveaway winner. Look at this, I got baits all over the place. And this is what I'm about to give away right now. We got the 360 GT search baits. We got the Yum Mud Minnows. We got a Cotton Cordell lipless crankbait. And we got some Yum Plastic Worms. If you left a comment on the video where I lost my rod, you are entered to win here. Let's load the comments. Still going. 598 original comments. Let's see if I can get this lined up and pick it on the first try. And the winner is Richard Faircloth Outdoors. He says, nice giveaway. All right, Richard Faircloth Outdoors. I'm going to call you RFO. You just won the giveaway. All you have to do is send me an email realisticfishing at gmail.com and get me that shipping information and we'll take it from there. Good luck to everyone else in today's giveaway. John, be expecting your package and thanks again to everyone who sends something into the show. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.